The 2018 FIFA World Cup season is here, and now it's a perfect time to look back at the tournament's most celebrated players. Now in this episode of FD Facts, I'll be highlighting the all-time leading scorers in FIFA World Cup history. Welcome back guys, my name is Leroy Kenton. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And before I get into this video, just gotta let you know that this episode of FTD Facts is brought to you by Pirates of the Caribbean, Tides of War. This is an amazing real-time strategy game that's available for Android and iOS devices. I have a link to that down below where you can download it and start playing it right now, as well as I have more information about it at the end of this video. So I'm gonna be counting down from number five down to number one, and starting off at number five, we have Pele. Pele played for Brazil and he scored 12 goals in 14 matches and that's an average of 0.86 goals per game. Pele started his professional career at Santos and spent most of his career there. During his career he had scored 619 goals in 638 games for the 8 times Campeonato Brasileiro Serie A champions as well as he had 1,281 total goals over his entire career. Next up we have the amazing striker Just Fun. Fontaine. Now, Just Fontaine, he played for France and he scored 13 goals in just six matches. And that's an average of 2.17 goals per game. Just Fontaine, he holds a record of scoring most goals in a single World Cup game 13 goals in the 1958 World Cup. Holy crap. He scored 30 goals during his entire career for the French national team. Moving on now into number three, we have Gerd Müller. Gerd Müller, he played for West Germany and he scored 14 goals in 13 World Cup matches. And that's an average of 1.08 goals per game. Gerd Müller started his career on the TSV 1861 Nordlingen German team where he scored 51 goals in just one season, and that broke all kinds of records. Now this earned him a spot on the Bayern Munich team where he scored another record-breaking 398 Bundesliga goals in 453 games. And because of this, he was the highest ever goal scorer in the Bundesliga German League history. Okay, so next up we have Ronaldo. Not to be confused with Cristiano Ronaldo who plays for Portugal. But Ronaldo, he played for the Brazil's national team and he scored 15 goals in 19 matches. And that's an average of 0.79 goals scored per game. Ronaldo appeared in three World Cups and scored 15 goals in just 19 matches, as I just mentioned. So he's a three-time FIFA player of the year and he moved to Barcelona where he scored 34 goals in 37 games. But due to problems over over his contract negotiations at Barcelona, he had to leave Barcelona after just one season. He then moved to Inter Milan where he won the FIFA Club Footballer of the Year award during the 1997-1998 season. Ronaldo then moved to Real Madrid in 2002 where he won two La Liga titles. Ronaldo scored 62 goals in 98 games for Brazil's national team and he was a golden boot winner in the 2006 World Cup. Okay guys, one more player to talk about and that is Maris Slav Kloza. Mirosov Kloza, he played for Germany and he scored 16 goals in 24 matches and that's an average of 0.67 goals per game. And this is why the former Germany and Bayern Munich legend Mirosov Kloza tops this list. He holds a record for the most goals in a World Cup history. He broke the record in the World Cup 2014 previously held by Brazil's Ronaldo who scored 15 goals in 19 games. Born in Poland, Mirosław Kloza moved to Germany when he was 8 years old and then he started his professional career at FC 08 Hamburg and Mirosław Kloza is the record holding goal scorer for Germany and had 71 goals in 137 games for his entire career playing for the German national team. Okay guys, so that concludes this episode of the top goal scorers playing at the FIFA World Cup games in all of the history. In case you guys were curious, I know definitely I was. But moving on from one game to another, we have our sponsor for this episode, which is Pirates of the Caribbean, Tides of War. In this real-time strategy game, you're the captain of your own pirate haven. You get to build your own pirate base and recruit members to build your army and grow and grow to fight against supernatural creatures and pirates to dominate the ocean. The link is down below where you can download Pirates of the Caribbean Tides of War. It's available on both Android and iOS devices. So I have the link down below in this video description where you can install it right now and start playing right away. Okay guys, so that's enough from me. I'll see you guys real soon in another video. Be sure to check out our other World Cup episodes. You don't want to miss them.
Okay, everybody, here's a playlist that we have that's dedicated to just videos on the 2018 FIFA World Cup. We have player bios, we have general information about the FIFA World Cup games, as well as some other amazing and interesting facts that you definitely want to know. Thank you guys so much for watching. You have been super awesome, and I'll see you guys in another episode.